I became homeless, was in a domestic dispute with my husband. He had tried to murder me in front of my children and I ended up losing my job and we became homeless. We were separated for six months and he didn't accept it. He wanted me back and I didn't want him back no more. I didn't love him. And he busted through my restroom window and attacked me in my room with my children in prison. He started punching me until he knocked me out and while I was knocked out, beat me in the back of my head over 20 times and begged my son to run out the window and go get mommy help, so he did. I looked up and looked around and seen him standing over me with a bottle and something told me to get up, so I got off the bed and charged towards the front door. And when I charged towards the front door, my neighbor was standing there and he bolted out the door and took off. He was gone for three weeks till he was captured. He served 160 days in jail. I ended up getting terminated from the job and I couldn't afford my bills no more, so I ended up with no electricity, couldn't afford to pay my rent. I had just started purchasing my home and then when I stopped working, I couldn't afford my bills, so we ended up in the street. It was scary. Um, it got to the point where my last paycheck, I didn't know how I was gonna feed them because my last paycheck at my job, I rented a hotel and the last day that we were in the hotel, I didn't even have no way to feed them. We were living in my car for about a week. My friend had an abandoned apartment and she let us stay in there. And one night she calls me 11 o'clock at night and says, don't go back, you guys will get arrested and they're gonna take your kids. And I said, I can't do this. So I contacted a woman that used to be a part of the Salvation Army and the next day I had her interview and came in here and I moved in the shelter. So much stress just came off of me and relief and my kids' faces throughout the whole situation. My kids never had a down face. They always smiled and when I seen them happy, it made me happy. Best people I've ever met in my life. The people who come and stay with us at the Family Life Center are, have fallen on a t hard times and they don't have the resources to care for their little ones. And it breaks my heart because every mom wants to give the best for their children. I want to see the moms who come into the Family Life Center be able to have all the opportunities that I have for my own children. We've taken them to baseball games, we've taken them to Dallas Cowboy football games, just a number of other things that we have to, opportunities to take them to do. Just the smile that you see on a kid's face when they're with their parents and they're having a fun activity and they're not having to think about uh, where am I going to sleep, where am I going to work, what all the other worries in life. It's very rewarding to watch that happen with the family. We're not just a place to come and stay. We're a place to come and get help that you need to, to make your life over again. And we want to see people go from homelessness to having a home and a life and of not just life, not just surviving, but a vibrant life. Our reward is to see her succeed. I got up every day looking for a job. I had no transportation, no nothing when I got here. And so they had a job interview at the employment office and I went and that's how I got my job at the airport. Successfully completed everything I needed to here at the shelter and moved out and been doing my own thing for the last year, almost two years. I loved it here, I really did. I miss those days.